Hey everybody, it's Rylan and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Disney limited edition item review. Today we have the Beauty and the Beast 2017 live action Lumiere Candelabra figurine to review and unbox with all of you. But before I start talking more about this, if you are new to my channel and you have the same interests as I do, like Disney limited edition items, then please go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there. And then after you've hit that subscribe button, don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you are notified every single time I upload a brand new video. Let's go ahead and start with the exterior of the box. In the top corner it does say the Disney store. We have this beautiful picture of Lumiere and in the background we have the castle. In the top corner it does say holds taper candles half inch or 1.30 centimeters in diameter. Right down here we do have the Beauty and the Beast logo and then right next to that it does say Lumiere Candelabra limited edition figurine to 2000. So there are only 2000 of these candelabras made in the world. And over here we do have a picture of Emma Watson who plays plays Belle in the movie, and I love Emma Watson. If you guys follow my channel, you know I'm a big fan of Emma Watson playing Belle. On this side, we just have another picture of Lumiere, and it does say Lumiere Candelabra Limited Edition Figurine of 2000. And then on the back, we do have a commentary, and I always like to read the commentary to you guys. So it says, there, I brought it a little bit closer. Sorry about that ring light, you guys. That glare is so bad, but... We gotta get that lighting, that lighting though. Okay, it says, once the footman to the prince, Lumiere is now the leader of the servants turned household objects. With a grand wah personality, he enjoys having a good time and does not mind breaking the rules to do so. Kind and caring to everyone, Lumiere's one desire is to become a man again so he can be with his one true love, Plumette. And this motivates him to help Belle and the Beast discover their own enchanted romance. How cute. From Disney's live action retelling of the iconic film Beauty and the Beast, Disney store truly really captures Lumiere with meticulous detail. This limited edition figurine has been carefully crafted and is a must have for fans and collectors alike. And I love the background of the box, you guys. We have the staircase where Belle comes down and the Beast comes down and they walk down and they just like go and dance together. It's super cute. Now looking at the price, let's see right down here. USA $149.95, Canada $159.95. However, this is reselling on eBay for a pretty penny, you guys. Very very expensive. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get it out of the box and we are going to start the review of the actual candelabra. So hang on one second. Now before I review the actual item, I did wanna show you guys how it came inside the box. It came in this styrofoam case and it has plastic around it kind of protect it even more, but there was a styrofoam cover on it. So it didn't just come like this inside the box. There's actually a styrofoam cover on the front to really secure it inside. All right, and then it did come with a certificate of authenticity and it looks like I got number five of 2000 which is insane because I never ever get super super low numbers and this one to me is so so low I'm not a number guy but five I will definitely take okay so we have Lumiere out of the styrofoam casing out of the box and he looks super super cool you guys I do not have anything like this in my collection and I find it to be a very very special item just for that reason now if you're wondering why I'm wearing white gloves in all of my limited edition item reviews I will be wearing white gloves so I just wanted to let you guys know if you're new to my channel and you're like why is this guy wearing gloves that's why so it does come with three looks like little candles and these are fake candles you guys so don't try to go ahead and light them you can put real candles inside the top though if you wanted to I did mention the dimensions a little bit earlier in the video so if you want to know that I will actually put it in the description below just in case you don't want to like rewind it's totally fine but these guys they actually fit right inside the little holder so I'll go one two three now I know you can't see the top one and I will show you guys that in just a second and also I am going to switch to my macro lens so when I do that we will see this candelabra in so much more detail but you know it's not that big I feel I like I feel like in the pictures it seems so much bigger but it's really not that big it's kind of cool though because you can kind of like hold it like this and just be like I've come for my father come into the light or just I'm just like trying to repeat lines from the movie where Belle is holding the candlestick but look at that so that's pretty cool and I know that they come in different lengths so the two on the outer they're shorter and then the one in the middle is a little bit longer but it's so neat you guys I love it Oh my gosh, I'm considering on putting um, candles inside the holders like real candles, but then I would just be afraid of the wax dripping on it. But overall, this is really, really well done. All right, you guys, let's go ahead and switch to that macro lens and let's take a look at all of the fine details a little bit better. So hang on one second. Okay, everybody, so we have that macro lens in and we can see all of that detail now. We can get really close and just, you know, 
just love it even more. <laughs> now let's see, let's look at his face. There is Lumiere's face, and he almost looks a little bit sad. Yeah, he looks sad because he's been turned into an object, and all he wants to do is just be with Plumet again. But still, the detail on the face is pretty amazing. The fact that we can see that he is sad, that really says something about the artwork that went into this, um, this sculpt. So I'm actually gonna take out these candles so you can see how they insert. So you just see right here, and actually the candles are really cool, they're really well made, like it looks like they've been burning. And this portion just goes right into that hole like so, so you just go like that. Super easy, even the detail on here is really well done. Now apparently this is resin, and I don't know if resin is plastic or metal, maybe someone in the comment section can let me know, um, but it still feels pretty sturdy. It's pretty heavy too, I feel like it's pretty heavy. Now Cogsworth is way more heavy, but this one's, this one's a good weight. I say it's a pretty darn good weight, if you ask me. Um, but the bottom is actually my my most favorite part. I think it's beautiful. I think we have a lot going on, but I also think that it looks very much so like an antique. And I think they did a really, really good job with Lumiere, especially with this limited edition item. If you've seen my Funko Pop review on Lumiere, you would know that I wasn't too keen on the original character design of Lumiere, but he's truly grown on me, especially after seeing the movie. I actually, Lumiere is definitely one of my favorite characters, and I think that Ewan McGregor did a pretty good job. I really do. I think they all did a great job. Now, on the bottom, we do have our authentic Disney Store logo, and we also have some of these, like, little cushions. So if you want to it on your counter you don't have to worry about it a sliding off because these are like rubber so they'll stick and then B scratching your countertop or even scratching the bottom of this and something also really neat it does say limited edition 5 of 2000 so that's interesting I, I didn't even know that so make sure that your number on the bottom here matches with your certificate number because wouldn't that be uh, kind of scary if your certificate number did not match the bottom of your candelabra Overall, very beautiful. Very beautiful work here, Disney Store. You've impressed me yet once again. Okay, everybody, that pretty much wraps up my review and my unboxing of the limited edition Disney Store Lumiere Candelabra from Beauty and the Beast Live Action 2017. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure you go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. And don't forget to let me know in the comment section if you have this candelabra or if you want it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to be yourself because everyone else is already taken. Peace and love from me here in Los Angeles, California and I'll definitely see you guys all in my next review. Bye-bye. right down here. USA $149.95, Canada $159.95. However, this is reselling on eBay for a pretty penny, you guys. Very, very expensive. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get it out of the box, and we are going to start the review of the actual candelabra. So hang on one second. Now, before I review the actual item, I did want to show you guys how it came inside the box. It came in this styrofoam case, and it has plastic around it, kind of protect it even more. But there was a styrofoam cover on it, so it didn't just come like this inside the box. There's actually a styrofoam cover on the front to really secure it inside. All right, and then it did come with a certificate of authenticity, and it looks like I got number five of 2000, which is insane because I never ever get super, super low numbers. And this one to me is so, so low. I'm not a number guy, but five, I will definitely take. Okay, so we have Lumiere out of the styrofoam casing, out of the box, and he looks super, super cool, you guys. I do not have anything like this in my collection, and I find it to be a very, very special item, just for that reason. Now, if you're wondering why I'm wearing white gloves, in all of my limited edition item reviews, I will be wearing white gloves, so I just want Hey everybody, it's Rylan and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Disney limited edition item review. Today we have the Beauty and the Beast 2017 live action Lumiere Candelabra figurine to review and unbox with all of you. But before I start talking more about this, if you are new to my channel and you have the same interests as I do, like Disney limited edition items, then please go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there. And then after you've hit that subscribe button, don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you are notified every single time I 
upload a brand new video. Let's go ahead and start with the exterior of the box. In the top corner, it does say the Disney store. We have this beautiful picture of Lumiere, and in the background, we have the castle. In the top corner, it does say holds taper candles, half inch or 1.30 centimeters in diameter. Right down here, we do have the Beauty and the Beast logo, and then right next to that, it does say Lumiere Candelabra Limited Edition Figurine to 2000. So there are only 2000 of these candelabras made in the world. And over here, we do have a picture of Emma Watson, who plays Belle in the movie. And I love Emma Watson. If you guys follow my channel, you know I'm a big fan. I'll let you guys know if you're new to my channel and you're like, why is this guy wearing gloves? That's why. So it does come with three, it looks like, little candles. And these are fake candles, you guys, so don't try to go ahead and light them. You can put real candles inside the top, though, if you wanted to. I did mention the dimensions a little bit earlier in the video, so if you want to know that, I will actually put it in the description below, just in case you don't want to, like, rewind. It's totally fine. But these guys, they actually fit right inside the little holder. So I'll go one, two, three. Now I know you can't see the top one and I will show you guys that in just a second. And also I am going to switch to my macro lens. So when I do that, we will see this candelabra in so much more detail. But you know, it's not that big. I feel I, like I feel like in the pictures it seems so much bigger, but it's really not that big. It's kind of cool though, because you can kind of like hold it like this and just be like, I've come for my father. Come into the light. Or just, I'm just like trying to repeat lines from the movie where Belle is holding the candlestick but look at that so that's pretty cool and I know that they come in different lengths so the two on the outer they're shorter and then the one in the middle is a little bit longer but it's so neat you guys I love it oh my gosh I'm considering on putting um, candles inside the holders like real candles but then I would just be afraid of the wax dripping on it but overall this is really really well done all right you guys let's go ahead and switch to that macro lens and let's take a look at all of the fine details a little bit better so hang on one second Okay, everybody, so we have that macro lens in, and we can see all of that detail now. We can get really close and just, you know, just love it even more. <laughs> now, let's see. Let's look at his face. There is Lumiere's face, and he almost looks a little bit sad. Yeah, he looks sad because he's been turned into an object, and all he wants to do is just be with Plumet again. But still, the detail on the face is pretty amazing. The fact that we can see that he is sad, that really says something about the artwork that went into this um, um, the sculpt. So I'm actually going to take out these candles so you can see how they insert. So you just see right here. And actually the candles are really cool. They're really well made. Like it looks like they've been burning. And this portion just goes right into that hole like so. So you just go like that. Super easy. Even the detail on here is really well done. Now apparently this is resin. And I don't know if resin is plastic or metal. Maybe someone in the comment section of Emma Watson playing Bell. On this side we just have another picture of Lumiere and it does say Lumiere Candelabra limited edition figurine of 2000 and then on the back we do have a commentary and I always like to read the commentary to you guys so it says there I brought it a little bit closer sorry about that ring light you guys that glare is so bad but we got to get that lighting, that lighting though. Okay, it says, once the footman to the prince, Lumiere is now the leader of the servants turned household objects. With a grand wah personality, he enjoys having a good time and does not mind breaking the rules to do so. Kind and caring to everyone, Lumiere's one desire is to become a man again so he can be with his one true love, Plumette. And this motivates him to help Belle and the Beast discover their own enchanted romance. How cute. From Disney's live action retelling of the iconic film Beauty and the Beast, Disney store truly really captures Lumiere with meticulous detail. This limited edition figurine has been carefully crafted and is a must have for fans and collectors alike. And I love the background of the box, you guys. We have the staircase where Belle comes down and the Beast comes down and they walk down and they just like go and dance together. It's super cute. Now looking at the price, let's see.